today we make the stock flounder. We need the flounder, shrimp, scallops, a crab meat, garlic, parsley, a basil. Now to do the stuffed, I gotta start with the garlic. We chop the garlic. After chop the garlic, we put it inside this pan. Put the oil. Okay, I like to put it together. Couple of pieces of butter. And now we fry all this together. Now the garlic, it's almost ready. Now, we start with the shrimp. The scallops. Now the mix, you gotta cook for five or seven minutes. We use a black pepper. We chop some parsley. We put it together with the stuff over here. Little basil to give it more taste. It's almost ready, and before I take it out, I use a couple of spoon breadcrumb. Now it was cooked about five, seven minutes. The stuff that I make. We bring over here. Now this is the flat flounder. I was get the small, but you can get the big one and you can make the same thing. It's one and two. And now I gotta stop the with my stuff over here.
after you use another piece, the flounder, you go right on the top, like this. After you finish the put the filet on the top, you use a little bread crumb on the top of the flounder. On top of the flounder, after you put the bread, you use a little butter. Piece of butter on the top. And now it's ready to go in the oven for 400 degrees. About 15 minutes and the fluff flounder ready to go. Look at nice color. Really beautiful. That's it. Okay, let's try to put on a dish. The no break for me. Nice and it, oh, it's beautiful. This is the extra piece we put on the side. And let's set, you know, let's put a little basil, a little parsley on the side like this. And look at this. Okay. Let me test. Mm. So you got a leftover like I got over here. You can use some small dish. And you put it in the oven and you eat with no flounder, you eat only the stock. It's really good.